Yo my people them, CFC, Reese Blue, back with another video. This is just a Chelsea Player World Cup update. Regards to all the players who have qualified for the quarterfinals. So I'm gonna start off with Croatia and Chelsea's own Mateo Kovacic. Big you up Mateo Kovacic. Your team did well in the last game, obviously taking it to um penalty shootouts to win. And boy, Japan, it was not an easy game. It really wasn't. You guys dug in deep and, yeah, got the win on penalties. So congratulations, Kovacic, another good performance from you. Did you up. And then we move on to Brazil and Chelsea's own Thiago Silva. Thiago Silva, man. That last game that Brazil done, one of the best performances in this whole tournament. 4-0 at half time, the game was done. Win the first like half an hour, it was complete curtains, and you have been a big part in that. Not only was you cap did you captain Brazil to a win every time that you have played this in this World Cup, but you also got an assist for a Charleston's goal, and that was a hard goal, hard goal. You got an assist for that. Big you up. I can't lie, your performance at this World Cup simply outstanding. It goes to show that age is just a number. And you age like fire and wine, so please continue these great performances and hopefully um you'll come back a World Cup winner because in my what I think I feel like Brazil are gonna win the World Cup, but we shall wait and see. But nonetheless, great tournament from you so far, so big you up. And then we move on to England and Chelsea's own Conor Gallagher, Mason Mount, Raheem Sterling. First of all, I just want to tell everyone that obviously I didn't make an update about this, but Raheem Sterling, he did get his house got burgled and after everything, everything is fine. He is now going to be returning to England from the quarterfinal match in which they will play France. So like, um, it's good that he's going to return. Thankfully, everyone in his family is safe because he did mention that he wouldn't be coming back to the national team unless he could guarantee that his family is safe. And, I'm just happy that that is the case. It's sad news to know that he got Burwood, but there's always going to be people envious in this world. But the fact is, Raheem, you have millions upon millions and everything that you have lost, unless it's really significant for that someone else is given to you that might not be here anymore, you'll be able to replenish that. So I'm just happy to know that none of your family was hurt and everything can go on as normal as, um, as you can return back to England. So. But yep, um, so far, um, England, they obviously destroyed Senegal, like, a 3-0 win, it was comfortable, easily comfortable, the first 10 minutes was like the most rockiest bits, but after that, when England got their goal, it seemed to be lights out, because Senegal didn't do much, and obviously, Messi Man was able to come on in that game, um, Conor Gallagher hasn't played any minutes, but nonetheless, congratulations to you guys and England for qualifying for the quarterfinals where you guys will play France, one of the toughest matches, most highly anticipated matches of the quarterfinals. So good luck to you. Hopefully you guys can win because the aim is for a choice player to come back a World Cup winner. So hopefully you guys can do your thing and we can celebrate someone winning the World Cup. So good luck to you guys. Hopefully you win. And then, um, so last but not least, Morocco's own, Hakim Ziyech. Hakim Ziyech, hey yo, the performance you've been putting on, it's nothing that I wouldn't have expected because the fight that you show for this team is because of the country that you love. And not only that, a manager's putting faith in you and playing you in your best position. There's many people that will say that, oh, if you come back to Chelsea, you should be in the starting lineup. It's going to be, even if he starts, it's going to be different because he plays an effective role on the right hand side. We do not do that. Unless we are going to change to a 4 3 3, he ain't going to, we will not get the best out of him. We won't. And that's just how it is because when you have a guy playing his best position, getting trusted from the manager to know that even if you don't have a great game, you will start the next game. That's where you get the best out of these players. Same goes for like Pulisic, someone that if you play in his best position, you could get the best out of him. And in this tournament, he was one of the best. 
created one of the most chances in the tournament and he got knocked out in the last round so yeah man um Ziyash, I'm happy for your performances. Morocco, the performance you guys put on, true underdogs. Withstanding what Spain could do, all they could do is hold up the ball. They couldn't create that many chances due to the fact that you guys were solid at the back. And the fight that you guys have, especially when you're repping Palestine as well, throwing up all the flags, trying to bring all of um, all of that side of Africa um, as one because yeah man it's um, a big cause that you guys are fighting for and not only that you've made history and reaching the core finals for the first time in Morocco's history so big you up and hopefully you guys can beat Portugal in the next round to just put more chance of a Chelsea player winning the World Cup so Ziyash happy with your performances very happy for you and yeah man um, that's going to be it for me regarding this Chelsea player World Cup update the people that exited was Spain and Aspen Equator. Unlucky to you guys. Also, Christian Pulisic with the USA, they exited as well. And unfortunate. But we move. I believe those were the only players. No, Switzerland as well. Zacharia. And Zacharia did get game time as well, which is a good thing. So, while Switzerland got knocked out by Portugal. So. Unlucky to you guys that didn't make it, but congratulations to everyone that did. Big you man up. And hopefully everyone can win because no one from the Chelsea contingent are playing each other. So hopefully you guys can all win your games. Go through to the next rounds. But yeah, that's going to be it for me regarding this um, Chelsea Player World Cup update. Please like, share, subscribe to my channel. I'll be back with some watch longs tomorrow for, for the matches. So look out for them. But that's going to be it for me. Thank you to everyone participating in the watch alongs. It means a lot to me. Love for that. And I'll do some more videos and injury updates and transfer updates as well. So stay tuned. But that's going to be it for me. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat, and Facebook for more Chelsea content. I'm CFC Race Blue, and I'm out. Peace. Come on, Chelsea. Come on, Chelsea.